Hello friends, welcome back. In today's video, I will be doing an outdoor entryway makeover. I do not have a porch, but I have this entryway here, which they call a vestibule. Now here's an overview of some of the plants that I purchased for this little makeover here. But some of them I'm gonna use for my landscaping, so they all not gonna be in this video. That'll be in another video. Okay, here I am sitting in our garage, um, repotting these plants because it's kind of hot out. For those who don't know, I live in Florida and in summertime the sun is pretty hot. So here I am in our garage and I purchased a couple of these plants. So I have a thriller, I have a filler, and I have a spiller. Those are the three components that they say you need whenever you're doing a floor arrangement. So that's what I have. So I am just gonna repot these plants make a cute arrangement so I can put on my little rack right there. I purchased that little plant stand at Home Depot and I believe it was $29.99. Don't quote me, but I believe it was $29.99. Just to give you a heads up, this video was filmed in two days, so later on in the video, you will see me with a different set of clothing on. Right here are two other plants that I purchased. One is a little succulent, and another one is a little pink um, greenery, leaf greenery. I don't know what you call that plant. But I said I'm gonna try a succulent this time because I never purchased that type of plant. And I also purchased that cute little blue pot at um, Home Depot, I believe. And I think it was only $3.99 or $2.99, something like that. So here's an overview on how this space look here. I'm gonna get my blower and blow away some of these leaves and also try to blow away some of that pollen that's all over the place. Because here in Florida, we did get a lot of pollen. I don't know how it is in your area, but here in Florida, we did get it bad. And my allergy has been terrible. So I'm gonna try to um, blow away as much as I can and also wipe this um, bench down and also the cushion and the doors you know just to give this area a little cleaning Okay, here I am back with my bucket again with some water and some pine that's in there and I'm taking my little broom, wiping down around the doors and the walls to get all the spider webs and the little bumps out the corner. And then right there, left of the door, you see me digging in that little corner there. There was two hornets nests there. And matter of fact, the hornet is back because he's flying around, so I guess he was coming back to his home. So um, you can see him in a few minutes flying around here and then you will see the shadows. So I just hope that he don't bother me. If not, I'm gonna have to go and get my zapper because I'm not gonna get stung. And there he goes again. He is flying around because he's looking for his home. I would like to say if you're new here, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. My name is Carol. I'm a wife, a mother, and a grandmother. I just love to share decorating ideas, home decor, loads of cleaning and laundry motivation, also some delicious recipes, and doing DIY projects with my husband. So if this type of content interests you, then I hope you will consider subscribing to my channel by hitting that red subscribe button, tapping that notification bell, and don't forget to click all videos so you'll be notified when a new one has been launched. Thank you so much for stopping by and I hope I see you here.
So now that I'm all done cleaning the cushion on the bench, I was leaving, but then I thought I did not clean the transit window above the door. So I came back to clean that area. Okay, now that I'm all done cleaning the transit window, I'm gonna put these items away and I'm gonna come back with my basket wreath. And you see me guys, it's that hornet. I tell you, I gotta get that hornet. But anyway, this plat this um, door wreath, basket wreath I made last year, and I love how it turned out and I love how it looks on my door. So I'm bringing it back again this year. Okay, now right here I'm bringing back my doormat and as you can see the outside of the doormat is like a um, rubber so you see guys I had to go get my zapper yes I went and got my yellow zapper because I had enough of that hornet so I'm just washing around the outside of them of the doormat just to clean it from the um, green pollen that's all over it Now right here, I noticed that I did not clean our ring doorbell, so I'm just giving that ring doorbell a little cleaning. Okay, now I'm done with all that cleaning. Now I'm gonna bring forth these two pillows here that I purchased at Kirkland's last year, and I really love the colors, I love the pattern, and I love how it goes with our door wreath. And this little pom-pom pillow here, I purchased at Walmart this year. Now next I have this cute little fern that I purchased at Home Depot and I replanted it in this terracotta pot. So I'm just giving this terracotta pot a good cleaning because I used to have this pot laying down in my garden. So this year I decided to put a plant in it. So I'm just giving that pot just a good cleaning. And right here I'm bringing back my um, plant stand that I purchased at Home Depot in which I'm just going to line my plants on that stand. And I think it should look pretty cute in that little spot because it's not in the direct sunlight. Remember I mentioned previously in the video that the plants I purchased are part sun and part shade. So it gives just enough light right there in that little corner that the plant needs. And I also added rocks to the um, pots, to some of the pots with the plants. See right here, I added some rocks in there just to make it a look a little bit more festive and just to give it a little bit more dimension. And here's how it turned out. Now here I'm bringing back this plant stand that I keep on here every year. It's getting a little rusty but it's still standing so it still works. And in that black pot there, I planted some greenery. And here in this pot that I'm bringing forward to you right now, I have some orange and pink plants in there. So it looks pretty cute next to that pot with the greenery. And guys, here how it turned out. And I think it turned out beautifully. And we have a little balsa here, our water fountain. And I'm loving our door wreath. It looks so nice and refreshed. It's from last year, so it still looks good, so it still works. And I love how it coordinates with the um, pillows and also the outdoor rug. Everything coordinates with one another, and I am so happy about that. And guys, that will do it for this video. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. It really helps out my channel. And until next time, keep on smiling, stay encouraged, stay safe, be blessed, and I'll see y'all on my next video. And don't forget, I post every Tuesday, so I will see you next Tuesday. Bye-bye now.